Hi guys, it's Lucky here again and I welcome you back to our tutorial channel Wizard Tech. In this video, I'll be showing you a quick and a fast way for you to migrate your Windows 10 operating system from Windows 10 Home Edition to Windows 10 Professional. Now, there are a lot of benefits that comes when you are running the professional version of Windows 10. And some of these benefits include that you are going to have access to BitLocker encryption. You are equally going to have access to remote desktop control, which allows you to control your system from anywhere you are, even though you are not presently with the system at the moment. Another function I want to talk about here or feature that I want to illustrate here is that you can actually run a visual machine on your system, which gives you access to install another operating system on your the existing operating system. Like here, I have Windows 10. I can still run Windows 7 on this Windows 10. So these are some of the key features you are going to be leveraging when you have the Windows 10 Pro Edition running on your system. And then in just 5 seconds, I'll be showing you a quick way on how to actually migrate if you have the Windows 10 Home Edition on your system, on how to migrate the edition of Windows to Windows 10 Professional in just 5 seconds. Alright, now if you don't know how to check the edition of window that you are currently running on your system, this is how you are going to go about it. Now, if you are your, on your normal desktop background, the next thing you want to do is to click on this uh, search button here and uh, type in the setting. Move down to type in settings. Okay, so you open the setting option there and then you move to system. So from this system, you can just click down to uh, about. So from here, it's uh, you come down to Windows application. So this is where I'm going to find out uh, the features of the window that you are running on your system or the edition of window you are running on your system. As you can see here, uh, the edition I'm running on my system is a uh, Windows 10 Home. And then for, because of this Windows 10 Home I have on my system, I may not have access to some of all these features here. The remote desktop control and then the, the BitLocker encryption that I earlier talked about. So these are some of the features that you will be limited to if you are running the home edition of Windows 10. Alright, so with that being said, I will now be jumping you through on how to migrate or how to move your OS from Windows 10 Home to Windows 10 Professional. Now, there are two things that we're going to do here. First, we are going to open the uh, uh, file manager icon here. Then move up to this PC, right click and go to the properties option there. And then uh, you move down to change products key or upgrade your edition of Windows. So from here, you can just click on change product key. So this is where I'm going to type in my Microsoft license key. Now, I'm going to display this key on the screen so that you see the key and then what you need to do is just to type in this key and boom, upon restarting, you have your system running on Windows 10 Professional. So, I'm going to move ahead now and type this and before then, make sure that you have your system connected to the internet because what I'm going to do is that it's going to actually connect to the Microsoft server and from there, they will be able to access the key and see that the key is a genuine uh, key purchased from the Microsoft platform. So let's move ahead and type in this uh, 25 key character. Alright, so when you are done doing this, the next thing you want to do is to click on next. And then this option comes out asking you that you are about to migrate or you are going to update the feature of the windows that are running on your system. Now the next thing you want to do now is to make sure that you have closed all the apps that you are running all the software that you are running on your system because doing this is going to uh, shut down the software automatically so it is recommended that you close all the software or all the app that you have open on your system now when you are done with that next thing you want to do now is to click on start so now you can see the option there preparing for upgrade this might take a while don't want to turn off your pc now this uh this is actually going to get to 100 percent 
before the whole process will be completed. I'm going to fast forward this part of the video so and get it to the hundred percent when I got it to hundred percent and then we we'll see how we're going to go about it. Now, depending on the speed of your internet and the specification of your system, this thing should not take up to like a minute before this process will complete. Alright, so now this process is completed, the next thing you want to do now is to click on close. Forget about this or not to upgrade your edition. The next thing we are going to do is to click close this and then uh, restart our system so if you restart this system upon restarting it if you boot in the system you're going to find it on uh, windows 10 professional all right guys so now we're done with uh, restarting the system the next thing you want to do now is to check if actually the system has been moved from windows 10 home to windows 10 professional now we move back to the same uh, process that we took uh, previously by going to the file manager and uh, going up to this pc right click and move to the properties section and then um, when it comes to this option then you go to windows specification here i have my windows 10 uh, running on the uh, professional uh, edition and that is it for this uh, tutorial the steps we took is just to include a microsoft license key now what that key is going to do is going to migrate the addition of the window to windows 10 professional after putting the key you just restart your system and then you have your system running on windows 10 professional now just try this out and if in case you have any question on doing this or you may encounter any error white windows all you need to do is just to uh, on the comment section just type in the uh, the question and uh, i'll be available to answer your question right so and that's uh, brings us to the end of this uh, tutorial